All right, this question comes from Bill in Minneapolis. How do you think about investing in hardware versus software? Is hardware something Drive is comfortable investing in? Yeah, we get this question all the time. Uh, it's There's some version of the hardware is hard, so what does that mean for my business? Uh, and the reality is, is hardware is hard, but that doesn't mean it's impossible. Um, if you think about you know, why is hardware hard? As a startup, especially in the early days, so much of your success is about being able to find that product market fit. Uh, almost never do companies launch and immediately have it. So what does that mean? They need to be constantly iterating on the product, on the message, on everything that they're doing so that they can finally have that right fit for the market. And that means that innovation cycle needs to be as tight as possible, else you're gonna run out of time. With software, you can, you can tighten that cycle to almost hourly or daily in the early days. And with hardware, that's just not so because you need to deal with the supply chain. You're actually managing atoms instead of just managing bits. So can you be successful in the hardware business? Yes, you can. Uh, is it harder than it, than it is in software? Absolutely. And as we're trying to pick our windows on where we want to, where we want to take up risk, um, oftentimes we as venture investors will just say, you know what, life's hard enough. I'm not going to invest in hardware. At Drive Capital, we have invested in a number of hardware businesses, but they're not hardware in and of, of themselves. They might be hardware delivered, but they're still software companies underneath. So they're kind of in this weird middle ground where they still have to be mindful of that hardware product cycle, but the true innovation of what they're doing, what they spend all day, every day refining is on that software side. And that's to us is kind of that right middle ground when it comes to investing in hardware.